Hello, my name is Jana. I'll be helping you to make the puff balls that we have hanging up in our store that have become so popular. They're made out of tissue paper, and I've found that about 10 to 12 pieces of tissue paper gives you the fluffiness of puff ball that you want. You start out with the short side facing you and away from you, and the long sides to the side. You're going to accordion fold it back and forth from one short side to the next short side. And when you get all the way to the finish, you'll have something accordion folded that looks like this. What you'll want to do at that point is you'll want to fold it in half so that you can find the center. When you fold it in half, you'll want to take a piece of ribbon or string or fishing line works nice because it makes like, it looks like they're floating from the ceiling. And you're going to tie a knot. But it's secure, and from there you're going to start, hmm, skip to step. You'll want to do something to your edges. You can round your edges so that they look cute, or you can point your edges so they look kind of party-ish. I find that doing a little bit at a time makes it so the scissors don't hurt my fingers. There you go. From that point, you're going to take a single piece of tissue paper and pull it gently but firmly up towards the center without tearing it like I'm doing. If you do tear it a little bit, don't worry. Go ahead and take off the teared piece. There's enough tissue paper to cover up small bloopers. We'll bring it up towards the center like that until you have about half the tissue paper. And then you'll turn it over and do the same thing on the other side. And as you're working along, you're going to get more and more towards the center. until at the very end, you have them all pulled towards the middle. When you get to the end, you'll find it needs a little bit of fluffing. And then you have a beautiful puff ball. Puff balls are beautiful. Oh, magical puff balls, how I love you.